Your phone might keep losing cellular signal if you're in a low coverage area, your SIM card is loose or damaged, or if your network mode isn't compatible with your carrier's current setup. Other common causes include software bugs after an update, outdated carrier settings, or interference from other wireless features like Wi-Fi calling or VPNs. If you have a problem like this, the first thing you have to do is check your SIM card and reseed it properly because a loose or misaligned SIM can cause signal drops even in areas with strong reception. Use the SIM ejector tool to remove the SIM tray, inspect the card for any visible damage, gently wipe it clean, and place it back securely. After reinserting it, restart your phone and check if the signal stabilizes. If that doesn't fix the problem, try switching the network mode because your phone may be stuck on a frequency that your carrier doesn't support well in certain areas. Open settings, tap connections, then tap mobile networks. Select network mode and make sure it's set to 5G. If it's already set that way, switch it temporarily to LTE, wait a few seconds, then switch it back to 5G auto mode. This can help your phone refresh its connection to a stronger signal band. Another thing you can do is turn off Wi-Fi calling temporarily because it may cause signal conflicts, especially if the Wi-Fi connection is unstable. Go back to the connection screen, then select Wi-Fi calling. If it's enabled, turn it off and observe whether your cellular signal improves. This is particularly useful if the signal drops only when you're connected to Wi-Fi. You should also reset your mobile network settings because this removes corrupted or outdated configurations that might be interfering with stable signal reception. Open settings, tap general management, then tap reset. Choose reset mobile network settings and confirm. Your phone will restart and reconnect to the mobile network with refreshed settings. If you're still having problems, check for software updates and install any that are available because Samsung often includes connectivity fixes in new updates. Open settings, scroll down and tap software update. Tap download and install, and if an update is found, follow the on-screen instructions to complete it. You should also check for any carrier updates under mobile networks in the connections menu, especially if you recently changed your SIM or plan. These steps should help stabilize your Galaxy S25 Ultra's cellular signal and prevent it from dropping out randomly. If you're still having problems, it's worth contacting your carrier to see if there are any known outages or SIM card issues on their end. If you found this guide helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech solutions.